Well, training today was supposed to be a 2 or 2.30 report for a 3 o'clock start. That did not happen because of the chaos at Heathrow's Terminal 5. It was the first day of incoming and outgoing flights there today, and not surprisingly, there have been a few difficulties, and those difficulties have included some Chelsea players, so they are mortals like the rest of us, and sometimes they have to suffer those kind of problems. Andre Shevchenko, Carlo Cudicini, Michael Ballack, just a few of those who have been affected. Avram Grant was too. He didn't even get here till almost 4 o'clock. They have eventually had a training session earlier on. It was about two hours later than it should have been. The England boys had no problem getting here in time. Sean Wright Phillips brought his kids along just in case that they're a bit short of numbers for a six-a-side game. Ashley Cole and Joe Cole arrived at about the same time and are in pretty good spirits. As you can see, still not sulking too much from that defeat to France. In terms of the French, Claude Makélélé has been given special dispensation to not be here at training today because he is having dinner with the President Nicolas Sarkozy, who is over in England, as you may have heard. Friends in high places indeed. In terms of the injury news from last night, there isn't really a lot of it. John Terry, who missed the second half of that England game just as a, a precaution, there's no more news on his hamstring issue as yet, but no one expects that to be too serious. Frank Lampard sat out training today, didn't have to take part because still feeling a little queasy from the problems that kept him out of the England match last night. It's not just the full senior players who have been involved with airports and international fun and games. It's the youth team too. At 3.15 this morning they met up here at Cobham to go off to Sardinia for their little get-together for a few days in the sun before they come back for three days hard training and the first leg of that Youth Cup final. But for the first team, as I said, they eventually got a session underway a little bit late, but still at least it's club now, not country. No more international fixtures for uh, England certainly until the friendly with the USA at the end of May so it's club all the way Middlesbrough on Sunday.